Hey guys, it is Jacob here with another quick tip video. As you've noticed, they removed uh, mana sealed reservation efficiency from the talent tree and just from the trades as well. But I have a, like, yeah, a trick on how to help you with mana reservation. If you go to the warlock tree and check this of the beaten track plus for support skill level and support skills mana multiplier is fixed at 95%. If you get this in the warlock tree or you can get it on the on a <coughs> slate as well um, on the pedigree basically you can help yourself with mana seal if you use the right support on your auras or spirits or yeah on the passive skills basically what do i mean by the right supports <clears throat> if we check summon thunder spirit for example restrain gives you sealed mana reservation efficiency uh okay that's not what we are looking for i mean yes we are looking for this mod like i have it on my candles you can also craft the mod on dreamcraft for example on your belt Starting if you go here and I put the belt into this. Is the cat still alive? You or can get sealed <laughs> mana compensation here on this slot for example as well and I think on other slots as well through the dream crafting. So yeah this mod. But what we want to look for with this is actually uh, the mana multiplier up here which is pretty much an implicit of a support gem like if you check other support gems here this one has 110% this one has 110 110 as well on auras this one has 100 this one has 110 but if you have off the beaten track uh, this is fixed on 95% what that basically means is that if there is no like minus sealed reservation for example on this one there is minus sealed mana compensation which means the skill will get a uh, higher end cost then if if the if that line is not there this one the minus sealed mana compensation means that you have 95 percent multiplier which basically reduces your mana reservation on the skill like if i unequip this you can see i have less mana now and that works on every passive skill it also helps you with the mana ball degen if you put more supports to your mana boil it costs less mana yeah simple as that so it is easier to keep it up but on auras on summon thunder spirit as elemental duo that's that has no like uh, downside to it other supports like this one could also help if you had enough energy for that you could slot more for auras basically on every aura you want to use this because this one is free and 95 percent multiplier gives you five percent like mana cost efficiency on that restrain also 100 percent and even more but if you add increased area it, that gives you another 5% because this is fixed to 95% with of the beaten track because you can see here 3 mana if I put it back in 14 I could even go higher and get like a cooldown reduction as well for pretty much no reason just to be able to reserve more auras so this would give me even more mana yeah, and this lets me reserve two 50% auras plus one 10% aura plus under spirit. And if you unsocket this, and once you level up uh, restrain high enough, you don't even need any other like sealed mana compensation mod on any other piece, and you will be able to run two 50% auras, one 10% aura, and a spirit with just this simple trick, just put more put more links with the mana cost multiplier of 95 percent 
But once again, you need the off the beaten track passive point for that. So yeah, that's it for this quick video. Thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.